Hi, it's Chris Orders Stowe again of Wheelie Good Fitness and it's week six, our final exercise programme together. I hope you found it of use. I'm hoping that some of you will have improved and persevered and improved on your abilities and perhaps your fitness levels. And I also hope that maybe it's inspired some of you to continue with exercise. Obviously the videos will be around on Disability Horizons for you to keep using and keep improving, but you may want to move on to a local leisure centre or local services to do more exercise yourself. If you do, you can contact your local centres or if you visit the website for Activity Alliance, you can search by your postcode for centres that are more proactive with disability and fitness. Um, the other things to bear in mind as well is if you're unsure about it, go and check out somewhere first, see how you feel about it, find out what classes and what they offer and go and watch, observe, see whether it's something you think would be of interest to yourself and see what you think you can do and what might be a problem. And then ask to speak to the instructors or people who are responsible for the gym to have a one-to-one -to, -one to talk about your needs and raise any issues or concerns you have to ensure then you can move forwards knowing you've got the support there of somebody you know who understands you as an individual and wants you to get the best you can out of it. They're always daunting places, um, so you know, don't feel you're the only one there. Many people go along who look confident, who are busy in the gym, doing their classes, and actually they're probably thinking just like you, what are people thinking? What are people looking at me? What if this, what if that? You know, some people are just better at hiding it than others. So don't allow lack of confidence to wear away you and stop you doing things that you could end up benefiting from or enjoy. Okay, so Activity Alliance is a great place to start for finding out about the things in your area and as I say your local leisure centres and gyms etc. But just investigate it and if you just like anything in life, if you don't think you're going to get on with that person, try somewhere else, you know, because when you're working with an instructor you need to know that you feel comfortable with that person and you need to have a good comfortable relationship with them otherwise it's not going to progress. Right, straight on to our final workout then. So as promised, this is what we've already done. So the moves and things should be comfortable, but it's at a faster tempo. Some of the change is going to be a little bit quicker as well. So as always, make sure you're ready. Make sure you've got water on hand and a towel possibly. And take your breath in. Lifting up nice and tall to get your tall posture. And as you breathe out, allow that body to relax. But keep nice and tall. Same again. Breathing out and straight into your march. So marching through, bending through the elbows. Again, starting gently to warm our bodies up to loosen up those joints to get ourselves ready for working that cardio workout. So up the hands into shoulder lift, squeezing up, down, up. Don't forget to push all the way down. You want to increase that range of movement now. As things get easier, you need to push yourself further to get those gains. So up, down, back into your kickbacks, and reach, lift, reach, lift, and back, up. That's good, four more, reaching back, and up, and back. Two to go, get rid of your shoulder circles, four on the right, lead with the elbow, keep it nice and soft and comfortable, change to the left and round, two, Three, change back to the right. Keep that hand relaxed so your elbow moves freely. Left arm, and into your front raises, reaching up, down. Stretch your arms nice and long. Lengthen those fingers, and up, and down. Lift, lower, lift, and up, down. Up, back your Mars, take it to the side. Clench those hands, loosen up your fingers on the way down. That's it, use that core as well. Make sure you're coming up and down through the whole of your upper body. Where you've got thigh control, use those as well to squeeze. Edge your hugs and in, out, in, out. Right over left, left over right, and in, out. Keep your isolated top of that shoulder. In, out, back into those kickbacks and reach. Lift, stretch your fingers on the way back. Taking those arms right back now. You may have noticed that's getting a little bit further than when you first started, which is good if so. Two to go, and back, up, into those jacks, and lift, lower, lift. As you bring those arms out, lift your body up nice and tall. Pull the arms wide, 
up, down, up, two to go, lift, down, back to the beginning, and march it through. So I've had those shoulders a little bit more now. That's good. And march. Legs those hands. It's shoulder lifts and up, down, up, down, up. Four to go. And up, down, up. Two more, up. It's your kickbacks and reach, lift, stretch your fingers, don't get those thumbs as well. Lengthen the whole of the forearm and the hand and back. Shoulder circles, four again, lead a little bit bigger this time. Change sides and round. Two, three, change again. Right arm, for three, two, one, and left. That's good, front raise again, nice and long. Reach, down, take it all the way from your hips upwards now. Stretch, down, up, and reach, down, lift, two to go. And then back into that march. Take it across to the side. Use your body even more now to get that sideways movement. Keep going. Well done, getting ready for those hugs. Three, two, one, and in. Out. Left over right. And right over left. And in. Out. Squeeze. Squeeze. Two to go. In. Out, back into your kickbacks, reach, lift, stretch, and back, two, three, four to go, back, back, two more, get ready for those jacks again, here we go, and lift, down, lift, and lift, pull those arms higher now, and up, down, Roll it out, pushing out those arms. Getting rid of your kayaks. We're gonna do four at the sides, we're gonna straight into fours. In five, four, three, two, one, and push. Two, three, change sides, push it through. That's good, don't remember, push with the arm from the front, pull with the arm at the back, push. Into four sunshines, take it out nice and wide, rotation through the wrist and your forearm, left arm. Change back to the right and out. Two, three, four, left, two, three, four, and ski. Push it down, ski it nice and low. As we keep it going. Getting ready for your shoulder squeeze next. Front to back, and squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Pull those elbows back nice and tight. Bring the arms forwards, crossing them over as much as you can to stretch the back of those shoulders. Squeeze. Roll that both arms together, push it round. That's good, keep it going. Getting ready to go back to those kayaks again. Four again. Five, four. Three, two, one, and push, push. Well done, change it over. Keep your core nice and tight, getting that rotation through the upper body. To the left, push. Here come those sunshines. Four, three, two, change, push. Nice and long in the arm, keep that fluidity through the wrist. Change. Dance your skis, lock your elbows. Down that slope, keep the back nice and straight, allow that sideways movement. Dig in, imagine that resistance of the snow as you push down. Into those shoulders again, and squeeze. Release the hands as you bring the arms forwards. Clench the hands to squeeze back. Pull, pull. Well done, keep it going. Roll it out and round. Lengthen those arms nice and long now. Increasing that effort as you push it forwards. 
Getting ready to go back again to those kayaks. This time, twos. Here we go. One, two, change. Push. That's it, quicker changes now. Push it through. Keep going. Push. Same with your sunshine, two. Take it out. And change. And again, push. Change it through, nice and long. Keep that movement comfortable. And push. And ski, dig it in. Down we go. Keep it through the tops of those shoulders, locking those elbows. You're pulling through the upper arm. Keep going. And shoulder squeeze, pull, pull. Stretch the fingers forwards. Clench the hand as you pull back. That's it. Pull, pull. Getting ready to roll. Three, two, one, and roll. Pushing out those arms longer now. Keep it going. Get ready one more time. We'll go back to those kayaks. Two's again. Three, two, one, and push. Increase the size of those moves now where you can. Again, it's getting hard. Reduce the size to make it easier for yourself. Keep going. Push. Sunshine again, Sue's. One, two, change. And push. Well done. I hope you're enjoying this. Here we go and take water if you need to at any point. Shoulder squeeze. Pull. 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 Keep going. Pull. Pull. Get ready to ski. Three, two, one, and ski. Dig it down now. Well done, keep going. Push through the snow. Roll it out. Push the arms nice and long. Take them out wide as you bring them back. Use your core to keep it up nice and tight, but allow that flexion from your hips. And punch it up now with your arms up to the ceiling. Nice and tall. So this is a little bit slower, so it's a little bit of a breather. But by keeping those arms moving, we're gonna keep the heart rate elevated. Out to the side, don't forget to change in the chest. Punch it out, nice and wide, nice and long. But don't overextend and lock the elbows. And punch, punch. Get ready to go diagonal across the body. Alternate, and punch, punch, punch. Get that rotation through the core as much as you can now. Punch it through. Getting ready to take them forwards at shoulder height. Three, two, one, and punch, punch, punch. Well done, get ready to go back up again. Here we go, up to the ceiling, and lift, lift, lift. As he stretch nice and tall. Hop. Hop. And to the side now. Change to the chest again. Otherwise, you know what happens. We end up looking like Hawaiian dancers. Punch it out. Well done. Get ready to go diagonal again. Cross the knees. And punch. Punch. Use your core throughout. Keep it going. Punch, punch. And then take those arms forwards. Reaching nice and long now. Lifting up through your core. Well done, keep it going. Punch, punch, punch. Rolling out both arms together now. Push, push. Getting ready to ring our bells. Four sets of everything. So we're going to start from our nose. Nose is the height, we go with the hands. Three, two, one, and pull, pull, pull. As you get into that comfortable move now, relax the shoulders a little bit. Pull it through. That's good, now let's increase it. And pull, pull, 
Use that energy as you bring your arms in to lift your body weight up. And pull. Two, three, four to go. It gives you sunshine. Four, one, two. Again, try and get your arm near to um, nose height. Got where my nose wasn't. Change sides. And out. Two, three, four, one, two, three. Down to your kayaks. But four. Push it through, come higher at the front now. You need to work yourselves to elevate that heart rate. Especially if your fitness levels have improved. It may be more difficult to get there. Push it through. Shoulder squeeze nice and slow and squeeze. Cross, squeeze, squeeze. Four to go. Squeeze, squeeze. That's good. Back to rolling it out. Push the arms nice and long now, round. Keep it going, push, push, push. You're ready for your bells again. Slightly higher this time, let's come out to the eyes, or just above. That's how you're feeling, if you really want to work harder, go a little bit higher. That means the next one's going to be higher as well. And pull, two. Three, two sunshine, take it up to the same height as your things. <laughs> take it up to the same height you were doing your bells. Push the arm out. Keep it going. Dance your kayaks. Two again, coming up nice and high. And push, push. Keep going. Push, push. Get ready for the shoulder squeezes again. Slow to the beat, and squeeze, cross, squeeze, squeeze. Get those elbows near to short height if you can, squeeze. Two more. Roll it out again, and push those arms round. Get ready to go back to your bells again. We need to take them higher, top of the head this time if you can. Or if you're still a little bit lower at the beginning, Take it up just a fraction higher. Three, two, one, and ring. Ding, ding. I said, pull it through. Use that energy as you bring the arms up to lift your body up nice and tall. Squeeze your thighs and your glutes as well. Single sunshine up to head height now. Push the arm in nice and wide. Lengthen the hand. Stretch all your fingers. And that, out. Keep going. Single kayaks coming, here we go, and splish, splash, push it through the water, dig it in, keep going, get ready for that shoulder squeeze, we're going to pulse it to the front, to the back, and two, cross, two, cross, two, well done, keep going, squeeze, almost at the end of the build, which means we're almost at the peak, and roll it out, push them around again, one more time. We've got bounce again, highest you can manage. Again, keep it under control, make sure you're safe. It's getting too hard, ease off. Here we go, final set of everything on this. Three, two, one, and pull. Let your body go up nice and high now. Pull, two, three, four, keep going. Take a water if you need to at any point. Into a single sunshine, reaching high. Stretching nice and tall now. Hop, hop. That's good, keep going. Hop, hop. Almost there. Shoulder squeeze to the beat. Squeeze, squeeze. Kayak, push, push. Shoulder squeeze. Pull, pull. Kayak, push, push. And again, squeeze, squeeze. Kayaks, push. Shoulder squeezes, pull. Kayaks, four, three, two, ski. Lock those elbows now. Push you down the slope. Here's our peak, really work it. You can do this, you're doing really well. Well done, get ready for your travel line. Single, here we go, and up. Hop, hop, hop. 
Well done, lengthen those arms nice and long now, using your core to lift your body up and down as well. Here we go, into your jacks, and lift, lift. Crunch it through this area now as well. Well done. Here comes our favourite move, the hand cycle. Three, two, one, and round. In that sideways movement going as well. You want to make it harder, bring it higher. Here come those punches, it's four of everything. Three, two, one, and one, two, three, to side, punch. And diagonal, so across. And forwards, punch. Into a push down, up and down those shoulders and elbows. That's good, keep it going. You're almost there. Get ready to ski again. Five, four, three, two, one, and ski. We stand that slope harder now. Imagine you're racing against everybody else that's watching this. First one across the line. Well done, keep going. Single trap, lift, lift, lift. Take your body nice and tall now. Use your core to stabilize. Well then keep going. Here come those jacks, nice and big now. And lift, hop, hop, hop. Going through the tops of those arms now. Keep those elbows reasonably locked. Here comes the hand cycle. And round to the right, to the left, to the center. Take it higher, higher, ah, punch it out for two, side, diagonal, forwards and again, up, side, diagonal, forwards, push down, shoulders up and down, do you want to do another one, I think we might fit one more in, here we go. Don't blame me if it all goes wrong. Here we go. Down to those skis. Push, push, push. The reason I said don't blame me because we're going to do single punches. It's going to be absolute chaos. Get ready for those trap lines. I'm going to throw a few extras in. Here we go. Single, single, two. Single, single, two. Single, single, two. Single, single, two, and jack. Here we go, nice and high now. You are almost at the end, I promise. Hop, hop. Well done, get ready for that hand cycle. Here we go, and around. Take it high, take it low. Bring it down, have a bit of fun. To the centre, to the right, to the left. Here come those punches, up, side, diagonal, forward, up, side, diagonal, forward, up, side, diagonal, one more time, up, side, and push down, up and down those shoulders, ease up just slightly now, we are hitting into cool down, well done, if you manage the whole lot, well done. You managed hard, still well done, keep going. You'll get there in the end. Get your march, just sample up those shoulders. It's still the quick march, but we want to make it smaller to allow ourselves to cool down, to reduce our heart rate. So a little bit less power and effort now. If you're used to doing this, you know what I mean. And squeeze, down, squeeze, squeeze, down. That's good, and up, down. Into your little kick match, reaching back. I am very hot. I do this in front of studio lights. It's a lot warmer than probably see you at home. But it's been good fun. So easy back. Shoulder circles, four on the right. One, two, three. Change size, reduce that effort now. Back to the right. Back to the left. 
That's good. Front range, shoulder height only, no higher. If your heart rate is still really high, bring it down even lower. Because as soon as you bring those arms up, it elevates that heart rate. Especially if you go over shoulders, so keep it nice and gentle. Gentle march, nice and slow this time. That's good. And instead of our hugs, we're going to do shoulder squeeze front to back, nice and slow and gentle. So squeeze, squeeze, cross, cross. Squeeze, squeeze, cross and cross. Two more. Squeeze and cross. One to go. Squeeze, squeeze, cross. Into your kickbacks, reaching back and up. Soften up those wrists now, reduce that effort, allow your body to relax. Still keep good posture, but allow the rest of your body to relax. That's it. Get ready for your jacks again, really slow, lifting up, up, down, down, and up, up, down, down. Two more, up, up, down, down, up, up. Back to gentle march, sway it across, loosen up your shoulders now. It's more like on the dance floor. Loosen the body. That's good, get ready for those shoulder squeezes up and down. Relax the arms, squeeze, squeeze, push, push, squeeze, and push. Nice and slow, squeeze, and down, and squeeze, and down. Little kickbacks, more of a swing of the arms now. Just to dry them off. That's good, nice and gentle. Done. Gentle march, nice and easy, soften the wrists and land to really be relaxed and gentle. Getting ready to come to a stop and we're going to do our final stretches. In three, two, one. Cross your arms to your shoulder blades, stretch, reach up, all the way out, slowly down. Same again, reaching up nice and high, reaching out. Slowly down, loosen up the wrists, up into the elbows, up into the shoulders, and grab yourselves a really quick drink of water if you need it, or mop yourself up. And then we're going to move to our stretches. Again, take the left arm across the body and rotating through the middle. Take your head and shoulders around to the right to get that stretch between your shoulder blades and the top of the hips. Hold it there, and then take your breath in. And as you breathe out, take that stretch around even further to increase and develop it. And then slowly come back to the front, changing arms. So the right arm across the body, rotating round to the left. Again, try and take yourself a little bit further each time you do these stretches. Take a deep breath in. And as you breathe out, take that stretch that little bit further. And then slowly come back to the front, bring the arms forwards at shoulder height. As you bring them out, keep the palms facing forward, easing back, reaching out nice and wide to get that stretch right across the top of the chest and shoulders. Take a deep breath in. And as you breathe out, ease those arms further back to increase and develop that stretch. And then bring the arms down, place your left hand on the hip, flex down towards the floor. Get that stretch down the side of the body. Come back to upright, change over, right hand on your hip, left arm down to the side. Coming down, and back to upright. Bring both arms forwards. Imagine that rope on the end pulling you forwards. Keep your back straight, flexing from the hips, reaching in front of you as far as you can go, and then put a gentle arch in the lower back. And address those arms to make sure they're still as near to head or shoulder height as they can be. And hold that stretch in place. Relax the arms down, breathe in to come to upright. Take your right arm, lift your whole body up as high as you can go, flexing over, reaching up to the ceiling. Get that stretch right down the side of the body. And then bring that arm over, change your left arm, lifting up, flexing over. And relax, bring the arm down, take your right arm forwards, take it across the body, use the other arm as you usually do, or reach out with just the hand if you're doing it with a single arm. Change sides, left arm across again, keeping that shoulder down nice and low. And then bring your arms forwards, take 
Walking right to the side, turning the palms away this time, easing back, reaching out nice and wide and pulling back as far as you can go. And take a breath in. As you breathe out, ease those arms further back to increase and develop that stretch. Relax your arms down, bring your right arm forwards into your tricep stretch, reaching up, bending at the elbow, using the other hand on the arm to push back or walking your fingers down the back to get that stretch into your tricep. And then bring that arm over, changing to the other arm again, lifting up, easing back again, getting that stretch down into your tricep. And then bring the arm over, bring your hands together, apply gentle pressure, pushing down. Stretch your wrist and your forearm, uh, your wrist and your palms, and then push up to the ceiling as tall as you can be. Turn the hands out, reach out as wide as possible, slowly relaxing down. And then one more, bring the hands up again. This time, turn the palms up, stretch nice and tall. Bring the hands out, slowly down. Loosen up your wrists, up into your elbows and then up into your shoulders. Well done, you've been fantastic. I hope you're as, as wet as I am. Thank you so much for joining me and I hope you've enjoyed the, the last six weeks if you've been part of the whole six weeks. Thank you very much for joining me. I hope you found some benefit from it and I hope you, you know, this inspires you to do a little bit more on the exercise front and look after and maintain your bodies as, to the best of your abilities. Take care and I wish you all the best for 2019. Bye.